Health Minister Kairi Jamaluddin said he has received the completed report from the Attorney General's chambers on the proposal to decriminalise suicide attempts. Saya telah bawa satu uh, memorandum jemaah menteri untuk kita uh, adakan moratorium dahulu. Tapi waktu, waktu itu jemaah menteri kata lebih baik kita ada kajian daripada pihak AGC uh, sebelum sebarang keputusan dibuat sama ada moratorium ataupun pindaan uh, terus kepada uh, kanun keseksaan. Speaking to reporters in Putrajaya today, he said the report will be brought to the cabinet soon. He will also discuss the report's findings with other stakeholders which are the Home Ministry and the police. Dalam sesi ini, kita akan membincangkan hasil kajian yang telah diperolehi oleh AGC dan kita akan menyemak semula memorandum Jemaah Menteri yang telah pun disediakan untuk dibawa ke mesyuarat Jemaah Menteri. As such, he said whether this amendment will be tabled in the upcoming Day One Rakyat session starting next week will depend heavily on the Cabinet's decision on the memorandum. However, Kairi noted that the Home Ministry did not seem to agree with the decriminalisation of suicide when he brought it up the last time. Jadi kita tengoklah sama ada mereka boleh dipengaruhi uh, untuk menyokong uh, usaha untuk kita dikriminalisasikan cubaan bunuh diri ni sebab saya dengar masa mesyuarat tu pun hujah dia tak apa kukuh sangatlah bagi pihak saya sebagai menteri kesihatan Under section 309 of the penal code attempting suicide is punishable up to 1 year imprisonment a fine or both